I was just messing around here with uh, spawning stuff, and uh, we so we got this M1891, right? A five old five shot bolt action, no scope rifle, and the last notes I read, well, a couple patch notes ago, they were working on the lever action M the 1887 shotgun um, so I thought that was coming and we got this out of the blue which this was already in the cheats the Moss and Nagat or whatever however you pronounce that this 1891 model which is really pfft, could care less <coughs> and the Edder 22 Did we need another 15 shot 9 millimeter? I don't know. Because, and this is the point, this Spaz 12 gauge is in the, now I saw they're working on another shotgun in the the last notes before this update uh, called the DT-11. It's an over and under shotgun. Have you seen that in the patch notes, the news? But this Spaz 12 gauge, w w which would be really cool, you can't, you can't, you can spawn it, but you can't touch it can't hold it you can't load it this thing is already ready to go drop it in the game man make it work what's the problem this is the baddest shotgun in the, in the effing world man right here give us that also instead of the adder another nine millimeter this I noticed that this uh, 1911 spawns this is the 45 auto awesome gun man awesome gun and and that spawns and you can pick it up you can't put it in your hands you can spawn it it won't go in your hands you can pick it up I mean it's it's got the blurp it's it's done man <clears throat> why why don't we have these instead of this old five shot and an, another nine millimeter. Look at that beautiful 1911, man. All chromed. A 45 auto. Now that'll put down some zombs, man. Um, they said they have a driving skill, but I don't see it. I looked. Now, and you're going to have to have fuel. Also, the camera goes all the way around in a circle like this. You see that? Whereas it used to stop like he was looking over his shoulder. <coughs> You still can. You can equip a weapon in the car, um, so he'll have it when he gets out. So I'll say one for the shotgun, and you hear him. You hear the sound of him pulling it out. Now it's in my hands when I get out. And whatever position you're in when you get in, he'll do that. And you can switch weapons in the car. So, so I switch to the pistol. Did you hear that when I jump out? I got the pistol. But you still can't shoot out of the car. <coughs> they said they improved the handling. Um, I didn't notice a lot of handling, uh, but running over zombies is is much improved. So I found that you hit the, hit them with the, the the side, like in line with the tires, oh. and at like 60 kilometers an hour would be optimal if you go super fast they go right up and over so there's a speed see that took him out so that's been tweaked more which it sorely needed this needs a lot more work see that takes him out at about 60 if you go much faster and you could do 50 or, you know, thereabouts. They're still hitting you from a mile away, but you didn't get me. This was really bad when it came out. Look at all they spawned. So, don't go too fast. And try and hit them with the side, like in line with the tire if you can. Going really fast and running them dead center over the middle is the worst thing you can do. Which, see, I took them all out. So there you go. They still fly away when you run them over. Pew! 
shot him out to the side. So let's hit this guy about 60. With the tire, boom. Doesn't work every time. Where'd he go? So, glad to see they did some work on that. Really needed it. Good. Well, it should, man. Let's try 50. Yeah, the fat guy is harder to kill, see? Didn't kill him. That was too slow. So there's a sweet spot. This guy takes more shots. He went into the ground. But it killed him, I heard it. He's slow. It throws your car up. He went into the ground. Wow, weird. Look at them all. Up and over. You gotta have a run at them, and they're really fast. Then take out any of them here. This ought to be good. Right down the middle. This is kind of slow. It just sends them up in the air. This isn't really fast enough. There's a good point. They're so fast, for you to turn around and get up to speed, you can. Whoa, that was some good hang time in the air on that one. Sixty is not that fast. And that just, uh, that didn't kill him. It should have. Fat boy just went right through. When you're going top speed, it doesn't have time to, you know, calculate it all. So, what was that, 60 or 70? Seems to be about optimal. At least 60, say, and hit him with the side. That did it, see? You get the death groan. You don't get any points for this, however.
He's not getting up on that. Um, I really like the camera goes all the way around now. Not too fast, not too slow. I'm getting the hit me sound, but it's not taking any help. Got him with the mirror. That's a kill. Can't go through that bush. See how they interact with each other now. Was pretty <laughs> That's pretty silly. Yeah, you don't want to go in the water with these. Uh-oh, it's got to get away, it's going to blow up. Sink with your gear on, you got to get the shore quick. If you drop your gear in water, you're not getting it back. dry off. So there's my thoughts on the guns and uh, the new vehicle dynamics. Catch on the flip side. We'll try the old fashioned way. Shooting them. Fat boy takes more bullets. All right. Over and out. See you.